in this video we are going to talk about integration by the substitution method so what do you mean by substitution method using substitution method can simplify any complex integrals into a simpler form of integrals let us go to the problems straight away in question number one we need to evaluate integral 2x plus 5 times x power 2 plus 5x the whole power 7 into dx and we have to use substitution method to solve the problem so as you see here we have two brackets one is like this one is like this with some power so what do you do you have to take the second bracket whatever inside the bracket that is your u so let me write u equal to x power 2 plus 5x D differentiate both sides with respect to x you will get du by dx is equal to 2x plus 5 or I can say du equal to 2x plus 5 times dx so now if you see whatever here this is nothing but the remaining terms in the problem right so now what I do I can convert the entire problem into like this so in place of 2x plus 5 times dx I can write simply du okay what is remaining remaining will be x power 2 plus 5 the whole power 7 okay so in the beginning I have taken x power 2 plus 5x as u so here this will become u to the power 7 so my complicated integral now becomes a simplest integral now what is the meaning integration of u power 7 into du so that means this will give you u power 8 over 8 plus c in the last step the value of u replaced by this one so here u equal to x power 2 plus 5x the whole power 8 divided by 8 plus c so remember always you have to express the final answer in terms of x not in terms of u because u is the variable substitu substituted by u in the beginning okay let us see question number two in question number one we have two kinds of bracket with some power over here now if you see the integration there is no bracket but you have a radical sign 7x plus 9 times dx so whenever radical sign is given whatever inside the radical that is going to be your substituted variable so let me take u equal to 7x plus 9 so du by dx equal to 7 or i can say equal to 7 or i can say du by 7 is equal to dx okay now the given integral becomes integral square root of 7x plus 9 i have taken 7x plus 9 as u so this will become square root of u remaining we have dx the dx is equal to du by 7 so in place of dx i can write du by 7 before integration take the constant 1 over 7 outside and i can write square root of u as half times du so then by integrating this this will give you u power 3 by 2 over 3 by 2 plus c so this will become 1 by 7 the denominator 3 by 2 will change to 2 by 3 and we have u power 3 by 2 plus c now this will give you 2 by 21 as i told you in the last question in the last step before writing the final answer i have to change u value so what is u here u is nothing but 7x plus 9 so in place of u again i have to write 7x plus 9 this all to the power 3 by 2 plus c Question number 3 sometimes you have dealing with exponential function so here we have 3x power 2 e to the power 2x power 3 so whenever e power function is given you have to take whatever in the power of exponential as your 
u okay so this question u is equal to 2x power 3 so du by dx will give you 6x power 2 or i can say du equal to this number 6 i can write 2 times of 3x power 2 and dx now let us bring 2 in the down so du by 2 equal to 3x power 2 into dx so now the given problem becomes that is the given problem is integral 3x power 2 e power 2x power 3 into dx so this problem now will convert into integral in place of 3x squared and dx i can write this one right du by 2 okay what is remaining the remaining will be e to the power 2x power 3 this 2x power 3 i can write u so this will become e power u into du by 2 so once again before integration let me take 1 by 2 outside we have left with e power u into du we know that integration of e power u is nothing but e power u plus c now we are in the last step so as i told you before whenever you are writing the final answer it should be in terms of x only so this u can be replaced by this value 2x power 3 so this will be 2x power 3 plus c question number 4 now we have given two brackets one bracket is here another bracket or parenthesis is here before the second bracket there is a trigonometric value sine or cosine whatever is given sine or cosine you have to make the substitution for that term so u equal to the second bracket which is x power 3 plus 4x plus 5 so du by dx equal to derivative of x power 3 is 3x power 2 derivative of 4x is 4 so du equal to 3x power 2 plus 4 times dx so now the given problem becomes integral for this term 3x power 2 plus 4 and dx it is here so this is nothing but du so i can write du then what is remaining the remaining will be this one sine x power 3 plus 4x plus 5 x power 3 plus 4x plus 5 is nothing but u so this one i can write sine u okay so i have converted this complicated problem into a simple form of integral sin u into du now it's very simple integration of sin u will be cosine u plus c then as usual before writing the final answer this u replaced by this value so here u equal to x power 3 plus 4x plus 5 plus c Question number 5 evaluate integral 2 over x ln x power 2 so now i have to make the substitution u for the variable ln x so if i differentiate both side by x this will give you 1 by x or i can write du equal to dx over x now the given problem that is 2x ln x power 2 into dx will become so this dx over x so this dx over x is here right this is nothing but du so for that i will write du this number 2 take outside 2 then what is remaining the remaining will be ln x and what is ln x ln x is u so this i can change to u power 2 now 2 integration of u power 2 will be u power 3 by 3 after integration c so this will be 2 by 3 in the final stage we have to replace u value so here u value is ln x so i can write ln x power 3 plus c so now you have five problems for you to
do the problems by yourself in the right hand side we will, as usual we will give you the solution also try yourself see you in the next video